the Ministry of Education and the Teachers Service Commission to form a dedicated technical team responsible for implementing the recommendations outlined in the Presidential Working Party on Education Reforms, addressing officials from both entities. During a gathering at his official residence in Karen, Nairobi, the deputy president emphasized the importance of a collaborative efforts, highlighting that reforms pursued independently by the two agencies can hinder progress. and have a common uh, stand on the implementation of the recommendations. We don't want a parallel effort because it will not help uh, the process. So we want to understand what TSE wants, it is fair enough. What the ministry wants is fair enough, but it must be within one framework. We cannot work at cross purpose. Uh, we cannot work differently because uh, we are one country, we are one government, we are one people, and uh, all this is, is to the benefit of our children, the, the benefit of the stakeholders of the educational system. The educational sector is so important to our administration and to the country, that is why we have appropriated 27% of the national budget to the, to the educational sector, you know, and uh, you know, and the importance of learning and our children and the sensitivity around the school space, uh, we cannot afford to get it wrong. There is beauty in harmony. There is success when people work together. It helps a lot when we all pull in the same direction. People may have divergent opinions, but there should be a forum where all those... Two matters 